Yo, what's up, guys? It's your boy here, and as you can see, your boy got a clean trim, you know? Got a haircut. How do I look? I look clean. Big E has finally won the WWE Championship, and I am happy that he won it because the almighty era is done. We're done with that. We are in the power of positivity era. We are now in the new era. Get it? Like the new day. But I want to talk about some things that I saw. So if you read the title, yeah, that's this is what people are saying on Instagram. That Big E only won the WWE Championship was because of AEW. And all I want to say is, just keep quiet. We don't care if he only won it because of AEW. No one cares. I'm just happy that Big E won it. When I saw that moment, I was very happy. I was 100% happy for him. But when that when those people kept saying, oh, AEW got in their head again, that just ruins the moment. Like, no one cares. No one freaking cares. I'm happy that Big E finally won the WWE Championship. He deserves it. After working with WWE for probably nine years or a decade, and yet people are still going to say that, oh, because of AEW. Like, shut up. No one cares. And just leave it alone. Big E finally won. That's all I care. And I'm happy because this is a fresh start to Monday Night Raw. This is a fresh, fresh start. Because Monday Night Raw has been improving lately. And with Big E as WWE Champion, I can't wait to see what the New Day brings in to the draft. Because again, the draft is happening on October 1st and on October 4th. And... I really want to see what goes on on Raw because Big E is a WWE Champion. There's so much to happen. You know, Big E confronted Roman Reigns. Like, oh, there's so much I want to go down. And plus, Roman is going to have a busy time with Brock, Finn, and now Big E. Oh, man. And now the match is set. Big E versus Roman Reigns at Survivor Series. The WWE Champion versus the Universal Champion. And to be honest, I was looking forward to Lashley versus Roman, but Big E versus Roman is better. I'm just saying that. I spit a little bit, but what I'm gonna see, I'm gonna tune in. I am tuning in. I think WWE now gets the memo that AEW is improving and now they're trying more. You know, they're trying their best because I heard SmackDown on September 10th was the highest grossing SmackDown episode of all time and boom many people say WWE is dying look at that this Smackdown this year got the highest grossing episode of all time to 99 to 2000 to any year this year got the highest grossing that's amazing it's showing that WWE is trying they're trying more you know with Biggie winning the world title with Roman having three feuds in one WWE is going better WWE is getting better and with AEW, how it looks, like, wrestling is getting better. Like, that's all I'm saying. But I am kind of sick and tired of the AEW mark saying, Big E won it because AEW is winning the ratings. Like, those are the things I hate. And it's pretty much annoying, and I wish it stopped. But it's never going to stop because that's social media. And social media is going to be a thing for a long time. But anyway, that's all I'm going to say. Uh, congrats to Big E for winning the WWE Championship. This is a fresh new start to WWE. With Roman becoming the greatest Universal Champion and him dominating the year. with And Big E becoming a fresh start to the WWE title. It feels good to be a wrestling fan again. Even though with, with like people counting on ratings, that doesn't matter. I'm just in it for the matches, the storylines. You know, with AEW, what's going on? And Monday Night Raw, SmackDown, NXT... I'm intrigued. I am all in. Not like that, but um, I am all in. But anyway, I'm in it there. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you guys enjoyed Big E's world title run, or if you guys enjoyed Big E's casting, give it a like. And make sure you guys subscribe to the channel if you're new. And turn on post notifications if you haven't to know when I upload a new video. And that's all I'm going to say. Thank you all for watching. And I'll see y'all later.